Why did they help me? That's uh, kind of what humans do. And the fact that you sent more than a few survivors our way didn't hurt. All for naught. We didn't pull you from the rubble to quit now. Envy holds the power of the Seven. Your betrayal can be seen on your face. Left for dead like some useless discarded thing. But it is not over. Here, take it. A gift from the Lord of Hollows. Deserves to be in stronger hands than mine. You know not what you offer, Horseman. You cannot be serious. It's important. Clearly, I'm not worthy. Don't you want it? This was not meant for me. The Lord of Hollows knew whom he was choosing. His faith will not be questioned. Not by me, anyway. What? This milestone should be acknowledged. If you won't do it, I'll do so for you. A reflecting pool? Aye, with a few... adjustments. But it's only meant for you. It will only take you to your heart's desire. I desire only to finish what the Council began. Find your resolve, Horseman. It's all you have now. And it is what you need if you're to stop envy and unseat your former masters. Sons of whores have had this coming for eons, and you have no one but yourselves to thank for it. Your lust for power will be your undoing, Envy. Well, isn't that the pot calling a kettle black? When I'm done here and you're nothing left but pebbles, I will simply wait out the apocalypse and destroy whatever weakened generals remain. Will be mine. It's over, Envy. You have failed. Kill her, horsemen. We command. Oh, shut up! You command nothing but my scorn, and you will know my fury soon enough. Trust for me, Trip. Yield or die, Envy! <laughs> Envy, 
you're about to feel next. Accomplished your task, Fury. Perhaps you should be rewarded. But perhaps not. Envy may have caught us unawares, but we have more than enough power to deal with an insect like you. You have overstepped your bounds, horseman. You shall be punished along with your brothers like the impudent child you are. I don't think it was made for you. Besides, feels pretty good. Such arrogance! Such gall! No, that would be pride! This is truth! And the truth is, this can destroy you! You'll never find out, wretch! Enraged. No doubt fueling the attack on Haven in secret. If you have a plan for them. The time is now. Heaven, hell, the Chard Council. They wish to see them annihilated. You know this, but perhaps you don't know the reason. Even before the apocalypse. Why were your lives so hard? Because you were created for a great purpose and left unprotected. So those who fear you have set out to destroy you with false promises and wars and sin that they blame on you. They all fear you. That fear can be used against them. 
humanity can win this war. Look around you. This is what's left of humanity, and we are in no shape to fight the war on the scale you suggest. No. You must hide. From the eyes of heaven and hell, the Council? That's exactly what must be done. But what humanity needs more than a good hidey hole is a protector. A protector? Powers in my possession to protect humanity. And one day, we will set things right together. Uthain, my brother, War, is an innocent in this drama. If you ever find an opportunity to assist him in any way, I would ask you to do so. I will. Thank you, Maker. May our future be one of justice. Hi. Safe travels, horseman. One remains unaware of the power she possesses. The Council will deliberate this turn, and they will send war to Earth. A mistake. The final seal will be broken, and I will revel in the chaos. You may go. <laughs> <laughs> 